For many Americans, this holiday season will be spent far away from home. Our brave men and women in uniform are often separated from family and friends during the holiday season. New Jersey National Guardsman First Lieutenant Katie Rumberger and her husband Major Paul Rumberger were stationed in Baghdad, Iraq last holiday season. Hi, I'm Lieutenant Katie Rumberger here at Camp Proper, Iraq, near Baghdad. I'd like to wish my mom and dad, David and Cindy Bailey, my friends, my family, Sam, Charlie, and Theo Rumberger, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I miss you and I love you and hi to everybody in Salem and Echo, New Jersey. This year, Paul wanted to make sure their holidays were different. Hi, Good Housekeeping. I'm Paul Rumberger. My wife, Katie, and I have just moved into our new home just in time for the holiday season. I was hoping you could help me surprise her with some decorating ideas for the whole family, including my three sons, Sam, Charlie, and Theo. Thank you. We're here in New Jersey at Paul and Katie Rumberger's new home to deck the halls with some holiday cheer. Hi, welcome. Hi, you must be Paul. I am. Paul, I'm Rebecca. I'm Rebecca, my wife Katie. Katie, Hi. nice, nice to, to meet you. This is Sarah Lyle, Good Housekeeping's hey, Lifestyle. Hey, nice, nice to meet you. you. Sarah, great to meet you too. We are Thanks. so excited to be here. Well, let's show you the house. Okay. Wow, this is an incredible space. We have the high ceilings. Wow, this is going to be fun to work with this room. Thank you. We don't have a lot of furniture yet. We're really looking forward to the holidays and furnishing our house, and we're looking for some great ideas. We have a ton of really fun holiday decorating ideas. The holidays are about family, and we have fun projects to add a whole lot of holiday spirit to your home. Well, why don't we show you the rest of the house, then? Sounds good. This is our dining room. It's wide open space, unfurnished at this point. This year, we're actually thinking of using our kitchen table for the holidays and really still want to make it special. Well, I have some great ideas for this room, and I actually need your help, so why don't we get started? All right, great. All right, so just because you're having Christmas dinner at your kitchen table does not mean it can't be special. This is a very fun, easy project to do. We've basically taken a simple table runner. You can get a plain one at any store inexpensively. We have matching napkins. So what we're going to be doing to it is we're going to be sprinkling snowflakes on your runner and your napkins. Okay. We start with a snowflake stencil. What you want to do is slip a little piece of parchment paper or wax paper underneath it because you don't want the, the paint to bleed through. So now let's position our stencil. We're gonna take a couple of pieces of tape just so it doesn't move around. Okay, so technique-wise, what you do, you take a sponge and you wanna make sure that you have plenty of paint on the sponge, but you also, you don't want the globby and the drippiness, so this is just a little tip. You take it and you sort of dab it inside a plastic cup or whatever you have handy okay. to make sure that it's saturated into the sponge, but again, not drippy. And the trick with stenciling is you don't brush and you dab oh. um, so that it doesn't go underneath your cutouts. Okay. Do you want to try it? Yeah, I would love to. Okay. You want to dab. Perfect. Okay. And you just keep going until you don't see any more of the fabric showing through. Perfect. Okay. Okay. So now you can remove the stencil as soon cool. as you're done painting. And Very voila, nice. you've got a snowflake. So you've got five more of these to do. Okay. I'm going to get started on the runner and then you can join me over here. Okay, great. you doing today? Good. Let's see, you must be Charlie because that says Charlie. Are you Charlie? Yeah. And you are? Sam. And how about Theo. you? Theo. Theo. Well, you guys, we are going to make some holiday ornaments that will be your very own. We're going to start with you, Charlie, and everybody needs to roll up their sleeves, okay? Because we're going to get dirty, and that's the whole point of this. Roll your sleeves up, put out your hands, and what I'm going to do is squirt this over, and I want you just to get them dirty, but we want them on the fingers and the thumbs. Let's see. Oh, awesome. Okay, you get one shot, Charlie. What are you gonna do, one hand at a time? Ooh. Okay, you hold on for just a second. I'm gonna get these guys going. We've got these really cool little ornaments. They come together in the end, but what you're gonna do is take a half and fill them up with whatever you want inside. We've got these really cool little dinosaurs and spiders and footballs. All right, Charlie, how you doing? Okay, now let's just push your fingers down. Okay, let's pull this off very gently. Cool. Let's see how these guys are doing. Oh, oh, we're gonna load them up. We are, aren't we, Theo? Now you can make more than one so you don't have to fill it up all at once. Okay, yours is ready. In. All right, now take a little bit of this ribbon. Take that. <gasps> That's yours. Yay. 
Okay, Paul, here's another great easy idea for the house. These are pine cones, and if you went to the store and bought these already painted, you're gonna spend some big bucks. True. We're gonna save you a lot of money. And just take a box and fill it up with some pine cones, pick out whatever sure. color you wanna use, and start spraying. All right. We're gonna be making luminaries. Have you ever seen luminaries? I have. These ones, we're making them a little bit fancier because they're gonna be inside. And the other changes, we're going with LED candles so oh, that they're safe. Nice. So here's how you make them. These are decorative edge scissors. Okay. Um, they make this cute little scalloped effect. Um, so you want to cut your green bag, which goes on the bottom, of course. Okay. Then the next step, you take a decorative hole punch. We have a cute Christmas tree here. You basically take it and you just squeeze, and it okay. does all the work for you. Wow, a great idea. And the last step really is to just trim off the top of these so that they match. So why don't okay. you get sure. started on those brown bags and I'll keep okay. punching. So I think you can finish this whole batch in you know, five, 10 minutes. Sorry, hon, looks like I'm gonna have to take over. You promised to take your mom to her eye doctor's appointment. Sarah, okay. this is Katie's mom, Cindy. Hey, Cindy. Hi, Sarah. Nice to meet you. Okay, nice to you I'm ready to go. All right, All right. see you All later. Right. See ya. So thank you for filling in for Katie. Sure. <laughs> You're doing a great job. Thanks. Oh, hey, guys. Hi. Oh, that does look nice. Hi. Hey, listen, so Katie just left. And you know, Paul, I know you really want to do something special for yeah. Katie. So we need to gather up the kids because we've got some great special ideas, special treats. So let's get everybody together and get sure. to work. All right. Hey, boys, we need your help. Come on. Why don't you take the pillows? <laughs> got them? Yes. OK, Ready? one, two, two three. three. Okay, now get ready. Your boys have been busy. Open your eyes. Take oh a look. Oh my, oh my God. Oh my God. Wow. Where did all the furniture come from? Wow. Our friends at JCPenney generously provided all of this beautiful furniture so you'll have a cozy room for the holidays. Oh my gosh. Wow. Remember the luminaries? Oh my God. Thank you so like much. <laughs> oh my God, them. that's so cute. Oh my gosh, all our pictures. Yes, we oh. Rebecca show them. What about the stockings? The oh, all the well, stockings they did. We marked time with their little hands, oh, and of course, we've got the ornaments oh, on the gosh, tree, the which tree will be a beautiful. tradition every year. So, a wonderful place to spend oh, your thank holidays you so much. this year. It's beautiful. Were, were you in on this? It certainly was, and the boys too. Oh, <laughs> it's very helpful. Well, we are thrilled that you like it. Remember that runner that we made? Yes. Let's go look at it. Okay. <laughs> Okay, take a look at this room. Oh Isn't my it great? gosh, it's gorgeous. The dining set is also from JCPenney, and the furniture accents and tabletop items are from their new Cindy Crawford line. Wow. And did you notice the table runner? Oh, it's what we did earlier today. Yeah, it is. Oh, it was gorgeous, and the napkins I did. I mean, they basically look store bought. Yeah, they yeah. really do. It's They're absolutely. beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, great job. Well, we really wanted to make sure that this holiday season was special, so you're all home together. On behalf of Good Housekeeping All Americans, we really want to thank you for what you do to keep our country yeah. safe. Thank, thank you. Guys. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. <laughs> Well, there was just one final surprise left. While we were working on the inside, our friends at Christmas Decor were busy giving the outside a holiday makeover. Take a look. Wow. Wow. <laughs> it's beautiful. Wow. Happy holidays.